Getting a haircut before Chinese New Year's is a must because anything during the holiday is considered bad luck. Here I am in Hong Kong at the Q Kuen Shanghai Barbershop where I'm going to meet with Mr. Go, who's going to tell us a little bit about where the superstition started from. And he's going to tell us a bit about what exactly is a Shanghai Barbershop. And at the same time, hopefully, he can do something with this. So come along. So earlier we were upstairs, and uh, typically on Tuesday he's closed, but because of Chinese New Year, just the business is too good, so he had to open. So men typically cut their hair at the bottom, and women get their perms and you know all that color dye upstairs, which is closed at the moment. So as you can see, it's quite busy right now. This is Chan Chun, right? I want to hear a dan dan tattoo. How many years have you been doing this? Five years. You are a Shanghai man? Yes, five years. It's been five or nine years. I was 14 years old. How many years did you learn to learn? Sixteen. Sixteen? How did you start? Yes. 有師傅教你定？梗係跟住師傅學下啦，要跟住人哋噶嘛。人哋師傅冇理由抓住你嘅手教你噶，你自己即係睇人哋點做，係嘛？咁今日我見到你好忙，係咪因為新年啊？新年咪人哋中國人哋風燭嘛，前兩個即係大時大節，梗係前兩個發過年啊嘛，開心啲噶嘛，儲夠力身啊嘛。係上海個禮法鋪係其實點有咩分別啊？傳統啊嘛，啊你話剃鬚，佢佢哋發現我邊度識剃鬚啊？嗱，你好似呢啲，你發現我企住唔識噶啦，再把刀同你慢慢剃係嘛？呢啲傳統嘅手指係嘛？剪咗兩隻。咁男定女都喺呢度剪髮，係男人多啲，收徒弟、收哥，而家冇啦，冇人學師啦，冇做師傅咯，自己闖天下啦嘛，冇理想啦，跟住我哋噶嘛，呢啲刀唔利呢，即係當一當，咁咩啦？當一當啦，啊，呢啲日本嘅，佢可以旋轉，嗱，佢轉，啊。佢轉，當年萬萬幾係播一一張啊，三十幾四十年前啦，佢賣好多嘢咯。生意 OK OK， 我啲生意 OK。生意我哋幾人要嗰啲熟客啦嘛，要頭一睇我非法嗰啲，等幾個鐘嚟就等我嘅，翻去要嚟啊，慣咗嘛，轉慣咗嘛，你翻完嗰期唔啱嘅。咁今年你要幾多歲啊？你啊你話我咧？差唔多七十。係啊，七十。你幾時退休？做到唔喐得嗰陣時退休。So me and brother go, just finished my haircut, and funny enough, this style of haircut is called the pompadour, but in Cantonese it's actually dan tart. So Elaine just brought us egg tarts, and I don't really see the resemblance, but that's it is what it is. Until next time, please subscribe and uh, let me know if you want to see more exploits in Hong Kong. Uh, thanks for watching. Maybe it's my sensitive skin, but that's how sharp the razor was. New cut, new blood. <laughs>